Here we have J. Tom's Model Shop in Camborne in Cornwall. A fascinating place, a lot of really interesting models in here. So let's have a quick look inside, I'll take you across the road. Have a little look in the window first, there's quite a lot of American 118th scale models, as you can see. Getting a few Corgi 143rds. There's a there's a Auto World Elvis Presley car there. You have a couple of Salido, sorry, Salido and a Maisto where they think scale there. And more American 118th scale models up there. Some really nice GMPs, Acme models. A nice Maisto, the Maisto GT500 there, lovely. And here, of course, we have some very, very nice 118th scale models. Again, American film related ones, I think that's the uh, a film related one on the right there. So, let's have a look inside. Well, there's a little bit more in the window here, I didn't uh, show you. So let's have a look inside. Here we have the interior. Let's have a little look around the shop. My, well, I was doing hardware quite a, I still got bits of hardware around here now, you know. That's right. But I was doing that up to about two years ago, and the hardware shut down completely. Right. So now my major hardware supplier is gone. So there's some nice 143rd like that. scale models here. I actually bought a couple myself uh, <laughs> this morning. Awesome a couple of green lights. But now, um, you know, I, I get a few things from Booker or someone like that, but I don't do a lot oh, of hard work. Get the camera all, to focus right? up. I would if I could get the old bits and pieces. Right. Right. Oh, focus up, that's better. There we go. Now I got it, if I need any hardware, I've got to go out and buy it myself. So they pay some Jim's Cash and Carry or uh, something like that. No, no, no. Where right. before. We have some some nice white box like models like here. Toilet rolls mm. and, uh, the mess starts very liquid. I mean, it's handy to have it, you know. Sure. But before, a like, few wellies and salidos. I got three in one oil. I use it myself. Yeah. <laughs> you know. If you run out, you just grab the thing. Formula you know. One mini champs at the top. Some interesting really models there, the stuff from a few years ago. Beautiful Auto World Mustang there, GT3 350. That's a lovely model. But these, you know, they're not very colourful. They're not kicks, are they? You've got like, those are complete models, Yeah, they're all complete models, you know. You get some of this one. Variety of auto art. Oh, right. Norev, all Sunstar, yeah, well, yeah, Auto yeah. World again. Made. Stuff that you can't get very easily. <laughs> you don't see Auto <laughs> World models, well, they think scale Auto 99. World models very much. There's some model soldiers as well in there. You know, 50 quid's go pretty good. Very good, actually, yeah. yeah, yeah. But, um, that's a beautiful model. I've sold them all I think that's an Acme. I've got a French one there. Yeah. That is not... Dodge a, Coronet, I believe. Yeah. But that's an interesting one. That's a Sunstar. Yeah. And they also got little designs on Lurking in the, the shadows, the I think it's a CMC Mercedes. Mercedes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I know the next uh, British one i got coming in, the Bristol. We have the Detroit Schaefer, that looks like a Plymouth to me. That, Maybe um, a 65, 64 Belvedere, course, perhaps. Well, that we would nickname the flying yes. circus. Because the and some more model in, soldiers. <laughs> and they were just like circus planes coming through, you know. Not camouflage, just Yeah, planes. and the, all the British ones. You never see British ones like that. No, they're all plain. The French ones. Some more models over the back. They're all the German ones. You see, that's another one. See? 
various uh, just like automotive and home cleansing products for sale as well. So there's a few models here, some auto worlds. Some very nice models in this shop, I must say. That's the beauty of that uh, Dodge. What is it? Plymouth? Plymouth GTX? Sorry, Plymouth Roadrunner, I should say. Some more models over here. I got them there, I need two pound each. I mean, hmm. so that's the, that's the Chevy Nova we saw in the window there from the, uh, the film, I believe. That's a lovely model. That was a silver bullet, we saw that in the cabinet earlier on. Same as the Detroit Shaker model. Another one. I believe these these Cobras, which are made by look, Acme. I think these are the Acme Cobras are actually on special at the moment here. So let's have a look behind the counter here. There's some really nice models up there. Nice one, They're genuine think. French, those Solidos. They're made in France, not made right. in China. Yeah. That's a beautiful Acme Cuda AAR up there. Very nice. Some really nice stuff here. So perhaps we can have a few words with the proprietor here, You're Mr. Toms. Yeah. Uh. So how, how long have you run this model shop for Mr. Toms? Run it as a model shop for the last 21 years, I would say. Okay. Before that, it was an ironmongery shop. It was founded in 1913 by my grandfather. Wow, so it's been and the family all these years. Since. Yeah, fantastic. And you, you're kept quite busy here, are you? Very slow at the moment. Very slow. Right, okay. Well, perhaps people will see this on the net and yeah. perhaps pay you a visit. Well, you know? what happened, in fact, I mean, it was an ironmongery shop up to the time of the regeneration. And the regeneration with one-way streets sort of... Uh, Isolated Cross Street, for example. Ah, now, in 1996, according to the Tinner magazine, there was 90. Uh, sorry, there were 40 businesses in Cross Street. Today, forget about the hairdressers and odds and ends. There's only about five retail shops in Cross Street. Uh, we're one of them. Right. Okay. Uh, well, after the regeneration, I changed over to model cards because hardware mm. just disappeared. Yeah. And I'm yeah. just sort of. Struggling. Yeah. Well, you've got some beautiful stuff here. Well, I'm so. retired and things like that, so I just yeah. run it as a hobby, basically. Yeah. yeah. Well, I say hopefully, you know, people will I see like this. I like the stuff and... yourself, be honest. Yeah. Well, <laughs> don't we all? Don't You'd like them to see some of it go. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks very much for that. My pleasure. So, not a last look around this little uh, Aladdin's cave, I'd say. <laughs> <laughs> I try to get unusual stuff. Yeah, definitely. You have. You have. I mean, you, you rarely see one eighteenth scale um, auto. Sorry, auto world, not auto art. Auto, auto world. world. Good acne. Yeah. Really detailed. Yeah. Stuff. I got a. I think you're full of checkers of in Tatra over there, which is unusual. A, a customer. I'm here. trying to get the odd, <laughs> unusual car when I can. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Well. I, there you are. I do Thanks tanks very much. as well, and I do planes.